to Lisa Marvin Art. I have another idea and we don't know if it's gonna work as usual. Let's talk about my idea. Sometimes, I don't know if you've noticed, but if you're doing a swipe or sometimes if you blow too hard and you blow your pillow up over your colors, it still makes cells because of the density of everything. So I've done this a long time ago, kind of differently, but I've actually swiped my pillow paint over some colors and what happens is over time because it takes time for them to, to develop because the paint starts to sink you get really big juicy circular cells okay so i have from my last video some of my tri art liquid mirror left a lot of you were interested in it um of course because there's paint all over it you can't see but it's spelled t-r-i dash art it's a canadian company so i get it here in my art store so you'll have to kind of look it might be more expensive if you're not in canada i'm not sure now it's not really mirrory so it doesn't reflect like a mirror it's just very pearlescent um but kind of cool so my idea is i'm going to use a dark pillow now i have these left over they don't make them anymore sherwin williams color to go however i've been using um Benjamin Moore colored paints and they work uh, pretty good but this is kind of just what I have now I'm gonna lay my pillow down I'm gonna put my mirror down and I'm gonna do a swipe but instead of putting cell activator on my palette knife which I got from fluidart.co by the way um, I'm gonna put my pillow paint on the back of it and swipe and see what happens we'll probably have to wait a bit for the cells to develop. And then I was thinking of just with a smaller palette knife, using these colors to do a little swipe on top to see the difference. I have no idea if it's gonna work. Let's talk about colors. For our pigments, I have TLP Sea Glass, which I use a lot, love it. Um, this is TLP Shimmer, which is a green to gold-ish interference this one is ballet slipper super pretty pink and that is TLP Lagoon now for my tubes I've got three tubes I have Amsterdam turquoise green phthalo turquoise I made this custom color because I wanted a bit of pink to match there it might be a little not sure but what i did was i started with um amsterdam permanent red violet i added my white to it and it was a bit mm, like pepto bismol -y. so i added a dash of more i guess pepto bismol color venetian rose so that's this color hopefully it's not too i don't know what all right so let me move the paints and let's get to work Okay, I have my blue pillow down. I had to smooth it out a bit because there was a bit of color that wasn't mixed in. So, what am I doing? Yeah, so I'm just gonna lay, I might have too much down actually, let me make sure. Um, yeah, we'll see what happens. So I'm going to just do, lay my tri art down and swipe over it, right? Let's see what happens. I don't really know what's gonna happen, but you never know until you try. You like my songs? Okay. So, there that is. So, I'm gonna take my little guy, right? And we'll do. I could either just like swipe right on top, like from here, but why not just make sure? that I have right so I'm just taking my <clears throat> pillow paint and I'm smooching it right on just like I would the cell activator we'll see if this is a waste of time so there see cute little cells already okay now let me clean this and do the other side total cell explosion just FYI oh there's Penny <laughs> all 
All right, so let me wipe this off. Now, because the cells came fast, they might not actually stay um, that way. So maybe next time I would actually have my paint, uh, my color paint thicker because I was expecting a very slow um, cell poppage. Uh, yeah, let's go this way. Okay, see this is kind of more like it. So maybe because I brought like a thicker uh, piece of pillow over it, I don't know. But, I mean, cool to see, right? So something like this, you wouldn't really want to use it as if you're blowing out a bloom as a cell activator because they wouldn't hold. So now that we have this going on, so what have we learned? We see these cells, these here are still popping up. So we learned a thicker layer of paint is better and probably a thicker um, pouring medium is better. Okay. So I really like these bubbles right here. That's kind of what I was looking for. It's a really cool color. I don't even like super want to ruin it that much. How easy would it be just to do that? And like say, here's my art. Okay, so what don't I like? So why don't I do like a little swipe here? Because I'm enjoying this here. I think, I don't know. Okay. Um, should I just do like a layered, like put everything on here? No, that would be too crazy. Okay. But I have so many colors. Maybe I don't want to put so many colors. All right, let's see what happens. I'm just talking to myself. You know what? I might have to mix up. I might have to redo this and mix up thicker situation. Okay. That was the sea glass. This is the teal. Okay, Lagoon. Shimmer. Pepto pink. Ballet <laughs> uh, slipper. And this, oh, I mixed up my white Shelly Art Style Activator, which is Australian Floatrol, and Titanium White. I use Amsterdam. A few videos ago, I did a whole um, white cell activator video, and I tested 10 whole different brands, so check that out. I'm surprised how many of them actually work. Okay, I'm just going to like, I don't know, right? really pretty colors. I'm actually not hating my Pepto pink. That's cool. If I do say so myself. Uh, now, let's not ruin it. You know what I mean? So what am I doing with it? Um, all right, but I'm going to just stretch her out. So the background does not look like I wanted. However, because they're going to get all distorted, but do we care if they get distorted? Because at this point, the cute little cells I liked, they're gone. So I'm going to stretch this out back and forth to make my swipe thicker. It certainly is sparkly. Um, I might want to do another one. That's cool. This is like kind of cool looking at it this way. I do have to spin uh, a lot more paint off, but why don't I start spinning slowly? Let me move my paints out of the way. And then maybe I'll do another one. And since I don't have any of the mirrored left, I'll use uh, a piggy maybe, you know? But I'm actually not so mad about this. 
kind of like a metallic wave, you know? Okay, and let me thicken her up this way a bit. The bad thing about things being so sparkly is really hard to capture on camera. But this is a pretty cool piece. You can see the bottom cells, you can't even start, they're really like kind of sinking. It does look like rocks though. Get those boobles out. But I'm still liking it. I hope you guys can like see how cool it is. I'm gonna take you over to the light if my camera can even handle all the sparkle. Um, I do like my color combo and yeah. Okay. I mean, listen, is it what I wanted? No. <clears throat> is it kind of cool? Yes. So I'm going to take you to the light and then maybe we'll try another one with the piggies. So, or maybe not, I'm not sure. Stick around because I might, but maybe not. All right, let me know what you think. Thank you so much. If you enjoyed this video, like, share, subscribe, comment. What do you think of my layered pillow idea, which didn't exactly work the way I expected, but it kind of turned out cool anyways. Have a good day, bye. Okay, we're going to go for one more round and I've decided to switch it up. I'm switching to white pillow paint because it's thicker and also I'm going, I mixed up some more of the tri art uh, and I've made that thicker and I'm also, so I'm going to do the top half with the tri art and the bottom half I'm going to top with a two paint over sea glass to see if that stops the cell formation. And then we're gonna make like some sort of oceany. I really like the look of the glass over the dark did make it look very um, like a stormy clouds, which was cool, but we'll see if the white will do the trick or if I should put a dark color under it as well. Hmm, at least what to do, okay, whatever. That's just, this is my uh, Glidden Essentials eggshell. This is on a 12 inch round because that's what I've got going on here. Okay, so this is thicker. Maybe I'll put a little more in case I want to tilt. Do you think this is going to work? And these are the things you've got to do. You have to play around with your ideas, test different things, you know. Okay. So I'm wondering, should I, for fun, why don't I do that? You know what I'm gonna do? On the top part, I'm still gonna use my um, Anchors Away color to go as more of like a pillow, not a pillow, as a puddle of color. I'm just gonna mix it up a bit to make sure the color is mixed up. You can see like they mix like a hot pink color in there to make it blue, so I don't wanna see those lines. Okay, are we ready to do this test? So the top half, hmm, I don't want to like plop it right down. Lisa Marvin, you know what? We're going to be like, try to be more organized. Okay. So here we go. Do -do 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 -do. We'll see if this works, right? Okay. So the top half is going to be this. Two different pillow colors mixed together. We don't know how that's going to look. On top of that, I will do my tri art, which is quite thick. Okay. Am I just nuts? Probably. Okay. And then on the bottom half, I will do my pigment first and then the two paint on top. And why don't I go like this? Do 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 do. 
wasting so much paint. Okay. And teal. And we'll see if the thicker paints or the two paint kind of um, stop the cell formation so much. Now I do wish I had a bigger swiper, but I don't. So I'm gonna do like the same thing and just do a swipe. Let me get those air bubbles out. We don't want no blaze here. Yeah. Okay. So, oh, I'm going to put my pillow paint on the back and I'm gonna make it thick, thicker. Okay. And we'll see the cell formation and the difference, right? Okay, so I've kind of put out a thicker situation. Okay, let's clean that. Now, so I see already it's not forming as fast. Hopefully <laughs> something will form as it sinks around. Or we'll just have white. Like I see tiny little cells, but we'll see if anything is gonna pop out or not. And I'll do it on the, maybe I'll do it a little thinner, just in case, right? Okay, a little thinner. And I'm gonna go this way. Okay, now in this case, the air bubbles will help us because they will kind of make cells. Okay, now that I did that, let's see. Like, I'm seeing air bubbles pop, but I'm not necessarily seeing, well, maybe, let's not, you know. Now, technically, you're not supposed to torch house paints because of the dangerous fumes because part of me really wants to torch it to get those cells moving. Um, they're starting to form a little bit. And I know, remember I said it, you have to kind of be patient because over time it will. Um, but it's kind of cool maybe. Then I have to figure out, okay, where am I swiping my colors? Cause it does look kind of like beachy and wavy. Oh man, I really want to torch it, but people are going to get mad at me. Okay, I don't want people to get mad at me. People get mad at me all the time for things. Um, you know, all right, let's just be patient. Maybe I'll just speed this process up on the video. But I do see little cells popping up. Um, little tiny cells. So why don't I just get swiping and then hope that these cells develop even more, right? Okay, so what am I swiping? So if this is like the clouds and this is the beach, I, I love actually non-swiped things together. I, I'm liking this part right here. So why don't I actually just like swipe here, even though these cells are forming, I don't wanna ruin it too much but I do like what's happening right in the middle here. I am seeing cool cells pop up. Okay, stop talking and figure out what you're doing. Um, okay. Get this part off more. All right, I'm gonna do like the same kind of little swipe, all right? Just get to work, Lisa. Okay, so all the colors I have left by the way, so why don't I start with Lagoon? All right, I always get so nervous to like do something. All right, Lagoon. I do see the cells getting bigger, folks. Um, then I'll do Shimmer. All right, then I'll do my Pepto Pink. I'm sticking with that name, by the way. 
Then I'll do ballet slipper. These little cells are super round and cute. Okay, and I'll top it off with my phthalo turquoise. And put my cell activator on the back of my little knife. Right? And we'll do like a little wavy situation. Wavy situation. Pretty. Lo I love these colors together. I don't care what anyone says. Okay. Yep. We likey. Okay. So I really like the wave I just did. I still like that. And I wonder though if I should make this more wavy. It's kind of like a starry night. <clears throat> but these things are a little does look like a crazy wave but what if I just like make it more wave like you know just a little bit oh, I think I'm obsessed with my wave guys I'm like here All right, so what I've decided is I can take off some of that and take off some of that. So I'm gonna tilt back and forth first. I still like my little cells, and I, but I really like the top of my wave. So I'm gonna slowly get off this part. And you'll see the little cells start to grow. I actually like my cute little cells. Okay, we'll get off this part a little bit. I don't want to ruin my wave too much. Okay, I'm going to start to spin carefully, okay? But those little cute cells are forming, starting to form in a really cute fashion. All right, let's move that. Right. All right, let's get the bottom off a bit. I love these little rounds. Am I like obsessed with this? I know it's like a little crazy and busy, but it's also kind of cool. Just stretching it. Okay. You know what? I really like this. I do. Not gonna lie. I don't want to spend too much more, but I will get a little bit more of the bottom off. I hope you guys like this as much as I do. I just like that it's like different. There's different shapes to look at. I'm really loving those cute little pops of cells and um, yeah, it looks like a wave. So what do you want from me, right? All right. <laughs> Thanks for sticking around. I'm going to take you to the light. You guys let me know what you think. Is this winner winner, chicken dinner, Pepto-Bismol or, I don't know why I said Pepto-Bismol or should I work on it some more? I don't know. Let me know what you think. Have a good day. Bye-bye.